The final race of the day is a 10 furlong Betfred Middle Distance Championship. It's a leg one of the qualifiers. You get the final towards the back end of the season, and there's a ridiculous amount of runners in this for a dirt track. It's 0 to 100, which is a little high, I think. At the top, it's Nashville Hunter for Vinnie Gerard, Universal Star Michael Scala, Francesca Kamani, Dan Hughes, Thunder Thor for Craig Allen, Time in the Sun, David Hooley, Iron Hand, Steve C, Angelica Rouge, Padraig Hogan, Glass Doll. Craig Beck with Hope Springs, Kevin Meehan, Island 10, David Hooley, Eleanor, Joshua Sutherland, Sharona, James Shea, Tariff, Craig Beck with Warning, Kevin Meehan, Festival of Rain, Obi Wan, Kreinick and Mice, James uh, Shea, Silmi Kulbeck, CDJ Liggett, Cairo, Dan Padre Hogan, Fruitful Beach, Steve C, Tarbleville, Crunch, Sue Gray, Bushrod, John Morgan, Ruby Swirl, and Starlight, Alex Cherry, The Middleman, Graham Clutterbuck, Rio Memorium, Daniel French, and Kajol, Neil Mack. 26 runners on the all weather. Absolutely ridiculous. And I thought this was supposed to be. Anyway, they're off and racing. If you're drawn in the outside eight or somewhere, I'd forget it if I were you. Um, these are supposed to be. But, um, sort of championship races for the lower grade trainers and why on earth it's 0 to 100 goodness only knows it should be 0 to 80 and no more and it's Iron Hand who's gone off into the lead from Festival of the Rain in second then they get a gap back to Time in the Sun Ruby Swirl in Eleanor and then after that Fruitful Beach and Hope Springs Francesca Kamalis after that one the other ridiculous thing about this is by the time we get to the final it'll probably have about four runners in it but it's Iron Hand who's in the lead from Festival of Rain in second gap of six lengths then to Tariff in third then after that one comes Fruitful Beach Ruby Swirl is next and then Time in the Sun Hope Springs is next out towards the back Middle Man Chronic Amice Cajol Silmi Colbert Royal Memorial Island Town Angelica Rouge for get all them and got absolutely no chance but it's Iron Hand in the lead from Festival of Rain in second Eleanor is third then comes Bushrod after that one Fruitful Beach is next Hope Springs Tariff after that then Thunder Thor when it's Iron Hand and Festival of Rain are well clear with four and a half furlongs to go Time in the Sun Fruitful Beach the Grey trying to come through with another one on the other ground the rally is Francesca Kamani I think that one won the Oaks a couple of seasons ago. That's how ridiculous it is to have this is a 0 to 100. Then after that one comes Thunder Thor. Hope Springs is next. Warning is trying to run on now as well. But it's Iron Hand in the lead. Thunder Thor coming through with a run. Francesca Camani the Grey is there as well. And Fruitful Beach Festival of Rain. Warning is trying to run on. But it's Iron Hand in the lead. Now being pressed by Thunder Thor as they hit the final two furlongs. It's Thunder Thor up the centre of the track who's in the lead. Iron Hand is in second. And in the third. Then Fruitful Beach. Francesca Camani still trying to run on. Time in the on his next one or two and trying to come through from the back. Warning finishing really well inside the final furlong, but it's still Thunder Thor in the lead. Thunder Thor in front from Warning Francesca Kamani down on this near side. Bushrod Nashville onto Sharona trying to get there as well, but it's Thunder Thor and Warning. And Thunder Thor's gonna hold on and take it. Thunder Thor wins it more in his second. Bushrod Francesca Kamani, Kreinick and Mice ran on well. And it was. Craig Allen sort of held on, I think. And the warning was getting closer with every stride, and a pretty disappointing race to end the week on, really, because that was a bit of a nightmare for some people. Let's take a look and see. Thunder Thor for Craig Allen, drawn one warning for Kevin Meehan, drawn 16. So if that one would have had a better draw, maybe it would have got a bit closer. Bushrod for John Morgan was also running on. In third, Francesca Cavani for Dan Hughes, fourth, and Tom and the son, David Hooley, fifth. You look at that, anything drawn above 16, 26, Ryan Memorial finished ninth. Look at the positions where they were, Thunderthor, 12th, 7th, 5th, and then 1st. You look at the ones down at, down at bottom, I mean, some of them 25th, 25th, 18th, 16th, 9th, 20th. No point at all running there. And I think if we're going to have these middle distance championships and things on the all weather when it comes to the final you look back last season virtually nobody runs in the final why on earth is it a 0 to 100 with 26 runners on the all weather crazy